Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you my early game method for Phantom Pain Cage. First of all, you're going to want to have two teams set up. Your first team is going to be your absolute strongest team and your second team can be whatever. Just a reminder for Phantom Pain Cage, you do not want to use the same character for two teams. As you can see from my first and second team, they're all unique characters. The reason why you want to do this is because in Phantom Pain Cage, every single character has their own AP, which is essentially like their stamina. Every single time you save your score, it's going to cost one AP. What you want to do is use your weaker team for the easier difficulties and then use your best team for the harder one you're scored based on how much damage you've dealt the remaining time left in the trial and how much remaining hp all three of your characters have combined together every time you go up in difficulty the maximum amount of points you can earn also goes up there is no reason for you to use your best team on the easier difficulties when you're going to score high on them pretty easily for the second difficulty i'm going to send in my weaker team s Karadina, a bianca and b live my s Karadina is basically my strongest character in that team she is using a leveled up level three weapon with four to five star memory that aren't even leveled up the other thing that i have leveled up with karenina is her skills even though my karenina is not tricked out she still dealt a good amount of damage on this difficulty and i earned 21,839 points now the gameplay that you see here is the third difficulty with the same exact team with my best performance I'm not going to lie to you. I've tried playing this trial multiple times with this team and my best score is 40,000. Every single time I've tried playing it, I got around 35,000. Now I'm going to try the same exact difficulty, but with a stronger team. Here I've got B Lucia, S Lee, and A Liv. Compared to my S Karenina, my S Lee is definitely stronger. I have an overclocked four-star weapon and overclocked six-star memories. Oh, I also have his skills leveled up. As you can see here, I've got a total of 47,196 points for this trial. This is a 7,000 point difference compared to my weaker team. Don't forget to claim your weeklies. I hope you guys found this video helpful and have a great rest of your day. Peace.